So, good afternoon, Internet. Um, right, I've got to get on with this job today. Um, I've got about an hour before um, we lose light, probably less before we get rain. Um, little job today on the Tigra over there. Just need to change the exhaust on it. Quite an easy job, three bolts at the front. Um, it certainly comes in two sections and uh, it should be just an hour's work. Um, do need to apologize for the voice. Um, as you've seen from other videos, uh, the whole family got the flu. Uh, unfortunately, I also got a viral infection and um, that went to my chest and um, all sorts of complications with that. And uh, I actually had a nice visit from some, for some <laughs> lovely paramedics as well and did a great review of the, um, the vehicle they use. <laughs> Probably feature on the channel later. No, it won't. <laughs> Last thing on my mind at that point, I can tell you, was to do a review of an ambulance. Anyway, less about me. Let's get on with the car. Um, Exhaust change, only two bits, uh, three bolts at the front on the manifold, then goes down to the back subframe where it's got a back box. So it's, it's only two joints, it should be quite simple. Getting it off, maybe not, but the air hammer will probably help. Right, let's waffle, I'm running out of time. So yeah, there's the exhaust that's got to go on. Um, it's not a big job to take them off, it's pretty much a uh, system from the manifold, which is three bolts, up to virtually the back axle. Um, well, the back sub arm, subframe, whatever you want to call it, and then the back box. So um, I'm going to get the car lifted up, and I'm going to get on with it. So there you go. Those are two bits of exhaust that have got to go on this uh, back box there, obviously, and the centre section up there. Um, so I've got the old exhaust dropped, <laughs> as you can see. And, yeah, it was a bit at it. Uh, I was going to try and fix it, but yeah, but I didn't go very well. So the joint is just up there. Um, I'm now going to get my trusty tool. Let me show yeah. you my trusty uh, air hammer and that should make short work of it. I hope anyway. Right, let's go. Right. Well, it didn't go quite as planned, <laughs> but it's off. So I think I'm going to drop those bolts at the uh, at the front and then try and slide it all out as one job lot. Uh, yeah, it's pretty rotten. So there you go. There's the manifold off. Um, let me just point you up there. So that's where it is. Three bolts hold it on. Um, there's a gasket there as well, which goes in between. So that'll have to go back. And I'll heat that up to uh, to kneel it again. Um, so now there's some rubbers up there. Drop those, and the whole lot should come off. Hey, <laughs> easy. Oh. Nearly forgot. Don't forget the O2 sensor. And this is where my special socket comes into its own. Look at that. Well, in the end, it was easier to unplug it. A uh, bit of a struggle to get up there, but I've done it. Um, that's out. There you go. Give that a bit of a clean up before we put it back in again. Looks all right, but um, you never know, dear. You can't tell. All right, we'll get that in the new one after a clean up. And then get the new exhaust on. There you go, a little bit of clean up, a little bit of copper grease on the threads just because. Um, so let's stick it back in the hole again. I need two hands for this because I don't want to cross thread it. And there you go, pride of place. So just uh, need to connect that back up again, which again, bit of a struggle, but we'll be all right. In she goes. In you go, my beauty. <laughs> God. Yeah, why did I try and film this bit? <laughs> right, there you go. <laughs> That's good enough for now. So, there's the plug you're aiming for. <laughs> Just up there. And easy, but it's doable. So, there you go. It's in place. A couple of nuts on there. Got the rubbers on there. Uh, got the plug back in again. So, just the back box. And we're done. There you go. All tightened up again. Right, let's feed her in. There you go, she slipped on. Just one bracket to do up. Fits in there nicely. Got plenty of wiggle room. Rattling's the bracket. So, um, yeah, pretty easy job. There you go then, we're done. 
all on, bracket all tight, bolts at the front tight, all the rubbers on, O2 sensor in, plenty of wiggle room, no banging, no clattering. So let's get the car axle stands out, let's get it uh, put back on its wheels and uh, see where we are. There you go, back on the ground, all sorted out. Hold exhaust out, we'll leave that there for the scrap man, he'll come and pick that up, they're pretty good around here. Right, time for the truth. Start her up. Ooh, that's quiet. Wow. That is, that's very quiet. I like it, I get quite like the noisy exhaust that I had. Um, but yeah. I don't think we've got any blows, let me just walk around the car. No, can't hear anything. There's a little bit of farting out the back there. Let's give it a rev, see what she sounds like. Hold on. Yeah, no noise whatsoever. <laughs> oh well, doesn't matter. If I want a bit of sound noise, I could put some noisy cam on there, but um, a good exhaust is more important than a noisy can. Right, that will do. Um, like I say, I'm just about to lose light. And uh, what are you doing, guys? Um, I'll say have a good weekend, because for me it's the weekend now. Don't plan on doing much more. Um, there's a couple of little jobs to do, but um, yeah, to be honest, this has really um, worn me out. I'm still not 100% yet, but such is life. Right, catch you later, internet. Bye-bye. <laughs>